All right. Well, it's been it's been a couple days, but I figured, eh, I haven't played Warframe in a in like a I think two weeks or something like that. So I figured I'd play this. Uh, I saw that there was some kind of Prime thing going on here. Let me check my inbox. So yeah. Looking for hard to find prime gear, void relics, prime weapons, prime warframes. You need to come to the bazaar. I got someone you need to meet. Would you believe she can produce prime gear from the past? Get your shiny butt over to the bazaar and see for yourself, Maru. Can do, Maru, can do. Now. I don't know what ways of obtaining these uh, prime things will be, but I do know that it is you're able to, so um, I just have to remember where it even is, because, okay, I think it's here, yep, because I have not been to Maru's Bazaar in uh, a while. I used to do it for, like, the daily... Ayatan treasures or whatever, but I have not done that in I don't even know how long so Because usually I would do Arbitration or whatever for that kind of thing and I would uh, get the um, uh, What is the essence called I can't remember But you basically spend it at the Arbiters of Hexis I think that's the name and then they'll give you rewards for it or whatever, so... I have not done that in a while either. You know, I haven't done a lot hey, of things that I used to. I'm turning everyone's Ayatan treasures into endo. Oh, Interested? okay. Okay, Maru. Hey, I forgot, I also reinstalled Windows on this as trade. well. So nothing is cached, and the performance until it is is probably going to be... Uh, it's gonna be a little bit laggy, but eh, as long as I'm not dropping frames as I used to, but I think the issue is after a while my um, wireless extender or whatever, because I don't have a direct connection to um, Ethernet, so I'm using an extender and my desktop does not have built-in Wi-Fi because the board is from like uh, nine ten years ago maybe more so uh yeah i'm just i'm using an extender and then using the ethernet on it from from that to the extender so um that's 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 the solution to that i'm looking for iantan treasures i'm looking to buy something you know huh. buy something so you're buying that's nice Keep a lookout for Tenno with something to sell. Yeah, no, 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 no. I thought I was supposed to come here for the thing. I guess it's over here because there's... Whoa, I can't even see. Stand up straight now. Let me look at you. Ayatan, Aya, Era, Rouse Wares. Might want to refine any relics you get. For Regal Aya. Okay, so I need that. Mag Prime? Wait, am I just... Like, I can just buy it? With these? But how do you get those? Whoa, there's a lot of things here. Are well, a lot more than I expected to, like, see right away. Boar Prime. Blueprint owned. I didn't... Uh, I thought I mastered this at some point. Eh, I guess not. Um, relics. Okay. First on Prime. Aya. And then this is what? Regal Aya. Okay. Yeah, I didn't understand what it was because I was seeing like... Um... In the streams or whatever for Warframe, I was seeing like Aya and I have no clue. I had no clue what that even meant. Like, You're oh, not I have settle this. For a rank and file Warframe, are you? Not when you could have Vanguard class. Ah, uh, no pressure. But this stuff might not be here next time. 
era. <sighs> Kid, I trade all this prime gear for a few shards of Sariglas, a hammer, and five minutes alone with whatever gilded bastard gave the sentience the key to the reservoir. <sighs> era hurt me. But if you kids hadn't showed up, he'd have killed me. And in my book, that means I owe ya. So, here I am. Okay. I attend, so wait. Whippings, massacres, executions, all their favorite memories. That's what the Orican used those pretty Ayatans for. Channeling Aya, the essence of memory. I just love watching Maru melt them down, erasing the Orican piece by piece. Some things deserve to be forgotten. Forever. Okay then. Oh, yeah. Orican sequencing medium. Pricks used it to archive everything. Memories, evidence, warframes. The Orican can rot in their own filth, but those prime frames? They deserve to live again. Regal Aya can make that happen. With Regal Aya, this foundry can reconstruct you a prime warframe yanked straight from my time. As real as my pretty face in front of yours. No guesswork. Okay, so wait, how do I... How do I get that, though? Well, good luck. Good, good luck, but how do I get that, though? I can talk to them, but how, how, how do, how do that? Equipment. Oh, that's right. There's no navigation here, so. Gotta go back to my ship to figure out how, how do, what do? Prime Resurgence, hotfix. Give your feline pal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awaken the Prime Vanguard. So is that what it is? How close that? Prime Resurgence. So that's the name of the event, or whatever you want to call it, but how do you, you gain... Earn new resource called Aya in game. Our instantly access Prime Warframes, their weapons and accessories with Regal Aya. Visit... Varzia and Maru's Bazaar to exchange Aya for Void Relics or Regal Aya for instant access to your favorite Prime items. Okay. For the new war, so... This, this is what they mentioned before that I remember hearing about. I just... How, how work? Buy now. Wait, what? Buy now? Buy now. What does that mean? Buy now. Current rotation. Buy now. Why is there a buy now button here? What does that mean? I'm gold plat. I I saw platinum in there. Buy now. What is that? Okay. Six regal Aya. Ten regal Aya. Oh. Okay. Okay. Six Regal Aya, how... How does it... How how work? How do? Question mark? I confuse? Regal Aya is tradable as non-tradable and non-refundable. Open relics for prime parts. Okay, so how do I... I get this in game somehow, but where do I get it from? Oh no, it's another thing. It's another, it's another microtransaction, but, oh, 20 bucks, 40 bucks, 80 dollars? Question mark? Prime advantage. Yeah, I, I understand the, the difference, but... Where can I find Aya? During Prime Resurgence, Aya will drop in place of the existing vaulted void relics during missions in the void, as well as bounties. You'll also be able to acquire air through relic packs in the in-game market or syndicate offerings. Okay. What items? Yeah, I... Yep, 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 yep. Who's Warzy? Yeah, 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 yeah. Former Dax Foundry Specialist. 
prime resurgence vendor can be found in Maru's Bazaar on Mars. Can you trade void relics? Yes, you can. Do the prime items come with inventory? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait. Yes. You purchase with Regal Aya. Okay. Regal Aya. Can I buy Excalibur Prime, Skana Prime, or Lotto Prime? Exclusive to the Founder Program, okay. Prime Weapons and Warframes Master Rank Locked. No if purchased with Regal Aya. So, Regal Aya is basically the... The... The way to get past everything else that you would need to do normally with a regular Warframe, I guess. It's like purchasing it with money. Like, just just platinum, like, buy platinum, purchase with platinum, and then you have the, uh, um, what do you call it? Catalysts or reactors, yeah. Come with platinum. Yeah, yeah, those do. Which items are exclusive to Regal Aya? Sinan... Okay. Cyandana's, uh, Sigatros, etc. are exclusive, available through trading Regal Aya with Varzia during this time. Where can I purchase? I don't want to purchase it. I want to... You cannot gift a Regal Aya. Will unused Regal Aya be refundable? No. Happened to any Aya after the event. Including ducats, customizations, and more. Same thing. Oh. Prime gaming exclusive gear, prime weapons, and many others. Okay. So, uh, question mark? I still... So the void are bounties. Does that mean... But what does that mean? Does that mean... Um, like bounties on Earth and Venus and whatever else, because I know, like those those are you know bounties, but and then the void. So what, like defense and stuff? If I go to the void and do a defense, well, I get Aya, and then how? How get Regal Aya? Do I buy Regal Aya with the regular? Aya, or can I not do that? Is there not a way to convert and you just have to actually spend money to get to get this this resource or is it it's not tradable so is it actually only money only purchase can only purchase with real money and if you don't have the real money to purchase it then you just don't ever get regal Aya because if that's the case well then that I'm just not ever going to get the, uh, certain items, question mark. Like, I, I don't understand still. I don't know. Um. I don't understand, but. But I guess I'll figure it out, question mark. This thing? Okay, appearance. Okay. Attachments. Yeah, I don't- I don't get it. I- I don't get it. I don't understand. I can... Um... Okay, customize. What do I even have as colors? All those Eve. I forgot I had these colors. Mm. Just do... I'm gonna do dark colors. You know what? I'll just do... Yeah, just straight up. And then this is the top of the... The hood. Yep. There we go. What do I even do for this color? Um, do that. Yeah, there we go. Now, now you're ready to go. Now you're ready for, for whatever. Um, do I even have? No, I don't have upgraded capacity. That's why I'm still, 
still using Carrier Prime. Besides, also, um, I think it's increased pickup range and can do something with ammo. I don't really know. I can't remember. But I guess I guess I'm gonna figure this out. So if I'm gonna do void, void stuff, void survival uh, type things, I think I'll go with Saren Prime and also do rank, form account usage. Here we go. Upgrade. Um. Okay, yeah, I'm ready. I just got the redeemer to rank up, I guess. So here we go. Into the void. From from my understanding, I think I think it's void void stuff and void stuff and doing bounties. But I don't see Yeah, wait. I'm also going to do Interface, chat, gameplay. No limit. Confirm. There we go. No ping limit. And now I'll see what happens. Is there more squads now that I have no ping limit? Yeah, there's one survival in mod. Oh, 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 oh. Here you go, here you go. Keep the enemy busy while a fellow tunnel operative raids the ship for supplies. Ready? Oh, I forgot what Trigger this was. I mixed up survival with defense, but that's, that's okay. Because I, I just kind of made this, um, for... I kind of have this set up for arbitration anyway, so... I think... It'll be... Oh, I forgot. This is a gun blade, so I can shoot with it. Yeah. There we go. Oh, I'm gonna have to get used to this again. Oh, I gotta get 20 kills while sliding. Okay, then. Okay, then. Can I get can I get kills while sliding though with this? I don't know. Cause it's not upgraded all the way either. Oh well I can just do I forgot these count as well. The the spores count as slide kills as well, so that's fine. Oh. I forgot what the void even was really. Like I've not played in well, almost three weeks now, and I've already forgotten what what anything was. But I've also been playing other stuff too, so... Oh. Oh, Argon Crystal. I don't even know where that was to mark it. Ouch. It's true. No, no. Don't worry that, please. The boat, and there, ain't none so bold there we go. People with nothing to lose. Hey, get out of here. do that. So now I'll do more damage. Put this on as well. So I'm gonna do some some toxin. Oh yeah, that's right. Since it's melee the shots count too. That's okay. So I got ranged toxic blast. Oh. I'm sorry pal. I didn't want to I didn't want to shoot you directly in your face like that. I'm trying to stay further back with this, but... There we go. What? Does this have a stance on it, though? I can't remember if I even put a stance or anything on this. I didn't even check my gear. I just said, oh, well, I'll take Saren, but I won't look at anything else that I have. Like, I just looked... I looked at the colors and said, oh, well, they match. So, 
That's all I did. That's all I did. That's how I got my gear ready. The colors look... The colors are all matching, so then now I take them. No, pretty much... Pretty much how I... I treat this game now, I guess. Because <laughs> usually I set them up... I set the weapons up and then I just don't... I don't do much else once they're set up. Like, unless I find something that looks like, oh, hey, this will do more damage, or this will be, you know, like, stat-wise, this looks like it might be better than it was before, or whatever, and then, then I do that. But, either way. Oh, okay, take care of. But hacking. Oh yeah, I was talking about before. So with that wireless extender, it's it'll drop frames for some reason until I reset it. So if I start dropping frames, pretty much the solution to it is, well, turn off the PC, disconnect it from. Well, either disconnect it or just turn off the extender itself and then let it reset because. For whatever reason, I don't know how how that happens, why that happens, but for ever, whatever reason, it does stop dropping frames and starts, like, download and upload speed faster after it's reset, so. Figured that out. So if I start to have problems, I'm not just gonna start, like, changing drivers and stuff. I'm gonna check that first. Because... I did it before, and I thought, hey, this did this did something, but then it, it didn't actually. Like, it, it didn't seem like it did, but it, it might have, and then it just had problems again randomly. Also, a thing is, like, the Logitech, the Logitech G-Hub drivers, for some reason, they, they interfere with, like, network drivers and other drivers because they get installed into Device Manager, well... They get installed into Windows through Device Manager, and then for some reason they have, like... There can be incompatibility with other drivers through that, just because it does do that that way. To connect to the device. So even if the software is not technically being used, like it's not open or running, it still can cause issues because it's literally... It's, like, embedded into... It's embedded into the um, the devices in Windows. So I also uh, tried figuring out a solution to that, but I don't really have one. If it starts to cause issues again, then I don't want to uninstall it, because I'm just going to end up installing it again, because to use the steering wheel, well, I need the, the drivers, like I need the, the software, so I can't I can't play anything with the steering wheel unless I have the, the G-Hub software. Because I don't have anything else that is connected Logitech-wise. I only have the steering wheel attached. But it doesn't just install drivers, it installs the software as well. So that's like two things to be, I guess, looking at. Because G-Hub uses... It uses some background CPU and a little bit of... Uh, resources, but it's not like... That doesn't seem to be an issue, it's more of the drivers can interfere with each other if something installs that does not, does not work with it, like they're just incompatible. Which I think is what happened before I reinstalled Windows is, oh well, the drivers are incompatible with each other, so then they just... They just, uh, they just don't work, and then it just drops my upload and download speed to well be below the speeds that I could be getting. So, because like it'll it'll drop down to like KB speeds, and I usually get like 11, 11 MB or something like that. So that's that's. To me, that's like significantly lower than normal, and I I don't want it to be like that. Obviously, when I'm trying to stream or something, because then I'd be uploading like 
I'd be uploading maybe, maybe at maximum like 500 KB or something, which is nowhere, nowhere is it recommended to do that unless I was doing like a stream in, I don't know, 72p or something. Because I, I don't think... Because for, for 720p, it's like, uh, uh, it's like, uh, what I've seen is 3,000 is recommended, but I do 2,500, just because I'm not, like, uh, I'm not affiliated or anything like that, not partnered, so I don't have the ability for people to to actually watch it in a lower resolution, like, because Twitch would, Twitch would then, um, I guess encode it technically, like a second time after it's already been encoded from the source, and then it would go through as, like, you could do 360p or even, like, one, I think it's maybe 160p? Like I, I don't, I don't remember the exact values for it, just because I don't have the option available to me. But um, I think, I think it's something like that. Uh, I'm not sure how low it can go actually, but it, it's beneficial for the viewer then because well, you can lower it to a lower resolution than if you're having trouble with playback or something. Like it'll, it'll basically be um, re-encoded so that you can watch it at a lower resolution. But again, it's only available to affiliates or whatever on Twitch, so there's not much I can do about that. I just tried to find a value that it would look... It would still look clear, but it wouldn't be like too high. Because when you're non-affiliated, so your bitrate or whatever is what dictates if people can watch or not, too. So if you're running a low bitrate stream, then you're more likely to be able to be watched. Well, not more likely to be watched, but the longer you fight, um, the more successful we will be. More than likely, there won't be an issue with watching the stream if someone were to try to watch it or whatever, because the bitrate is not too high for their Wi-Fi or internet, whatever they're using. Because then, then it would just either skip or just not play like if for for example like if you were watching a youtube video and then it would be buffering it would be the same thing for twitch if someone were to watch at a higher bit rate because well your internet doesn't support it so then our well it doesn't have enough bandwidth or enough uh like uh either like i would say download download speed or whatever to actually watch it so if you set it to like something like 6,000 uh, KB for your upload on your stream, then what's going to happen is that, well, someone would have to technically have that download speed to be able to watch your stream. Yeah, the quality would be, you know, better than someone who was using a lower bitrate or a lower, like, well, it'd be a lower resolution bitrate combination. At, at that, you could do probably 1080p 60, I think. But for um, what I'm using, I'm doing 720, 30. Yeah, 30. Because if I do 60, then I would have to raise it, but I don't want to raise it for people to not be able to watch, so... I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to leave it as it is. Um, so I haven't really been paying attention to what's going on with my team or anything, but where did they go? They're here. Oh yeah, there they are. I don't even know what Warframes they're using or anything. I haven't actually seen them since the beginning. I've just been like on my own in the rooms and stuff, so. But I think, I think when you're separated anyway, you get more um, life support drops too, so. It's not, I don't think it's necessarily a bad thing, but I wouldn't be able to see, I don't, I'm not able to get to them, I don't think, in time. I don't know if that's a, a pet or a teammate, actually. Um, that is a pet. Okay, someone's pet went down. 
That's unfortunate. Uh, let me get... Let me try to get back over there, actually. Guardian Xmas. No, no, no. No Guardian. Oh, I got my Molt, so then I'll heal a little bit. And I'll get a healing factor if I go down. Oh, there they are. There's a pet. I think that was a Kubro. Not a Kabat. But heckin'. So for the last couple days, I've been um, working like on stuff, I guess, for the for the about page. Like I changed um, the buttons. Yeah, the buttons, like the text and image panels. I changed them so that they actually match up um, to an extent, as well as like color-wise, they they just match. So. I've been doing that for a little bit, and then, uh, I've been trying to think of other things to do on top of that, but I don't know. I put a suggestion box down there as well in the about section, so if there's any, anything that you can think of to suggest, uh, it's, but it's got a 24 hour cooldown, so, uh, if you're gonna put anything, um, then... I guess just make sure that you get all, all your ideas out, because it can... Like, it doesn't matter how long it is or whatever, I don't think. I don't think there's a limit on characters or whatever, so if you have multiple ideas, just you can think of them and put them down there, and then um, I'll take a look at them, but... Because I've been thinking of games to play as well as... Um, as well as just what to do, uh, I guess with an overlay or something. Because I didn't really get an overlay for the stream yet or anything, I just kind of have, like, uh, the follower, like, the recent followers thing at the top, but I don't really know. Because I, I could just do, um, what do you call it, I could do some stuff in GIMP and I could make, like, a custom, uh, text box. Um, uh, border, and I could do, Hold out as long as you can. I could do technically a game overlay, uh, would, I, would I call it that? I guess it would just be a full overlay, like with the borders around the edges and stuff, I could do that, but then everything, like I, I don't want to scale the game down because then it'd be harder to see details and stuff anyway if I did that, so... Um, that's why I'm just trying to keep it, like, uh, minimalist, I guess you'd say. Besides just, like, the... Because up in the top right I did the name of the channel and then I did just the follower count thing. Because I didn't want to have too many things on screen that would block from being able to see the game. But also... Like, I didn't want to have... I guess I didn't want to have not anything. Because, like, I wanted to have the recent followers thing because, like, you know, I, I appreciate when people follow the channel or if they, if they, you know, are interested in the content or whatever. So I put that up there and then, um, like, I just, I don't know. I don't know what else I should be doing. Because I do have, I do technically have a, a chat box, I guess you'd say, but... It's only activated when people do type things in, so you wouldn't see it all the time. It, it was another choice to make, like, do I want to have a chat box always there, or do I want to have it, like, the text disappear after a certain amount of time, so it's not always on screen. So, unless multiple people were talking at once, then it wouldn't really be there. Because, uh, again, it was, it was another choice to be, oh, I don't want to have like, too, too many things on screen to block from watching the game, like, you know, I want people to be able to see the game that I was playing, you know, I don't want, I don't want them to, like, it's not necessarily a distraction, I just don't want it to block the screen, I guess, so it's, it's able to be seen. Um, okay, we're at 64%, we activated another, another thing. So how does this work is the question. Because I don't think I got any, like, of the Aya 
uh, yet. Or maybe I didn't, I just didn't see it. Because, like, is it a special pickup or is it something that I get at the end? That's, that's what I don't know. Like, I have no clue how the obtaining of it goes or how, how it works when you do obtain it. Like, can you exchange it for the Regal or can you just, or do you just use it? That, that's the question. Do you just use it or do you have to go through some other process to make it useful or whatever? Because, like, I thought, I thought it was going to be, like, some kind of quest thing, or maybe, like, an introduction to it, or it would be, it would give alerts for it. Maybe I didn't see it, but, um, I don't think there were any alerts for it, so I don't, I don't know what I should be doing, if I should be doing bounties or should be doing this. Because it did say void, like, I, I believe it said void. It didn't say anywhere else, as far as I know, besides Void and Bounties. So, um, I'm gonna check, like, one, once this is over, I guess I'll figure it out. But I'm gonna check Bounties as well. I'm gonna go to, I think I'll go to Earth to do that, just so I can know or not. But, yeah. Um, oh, what are they doing? Oh, they're doing, <laughs> they're doing a Naros thing. Just, like, eating them. For health, I think. Eat up, stay healthy. Literally. Just get health. In general. Okay. Open this up. Open this up. Let's see if I can get any life support modules from in here. Blow that up. Okay, it's blown up. Where the heck are the... Has this one got one? Nope. Okay, well... Oh! Almost missed that. There we go. Life support module. Oh, someone's bleeding out. Yep. Oh, they're getting revived. They're getting revived. Okay. Yeah, but it's been... Like I said, almost three weeks. So... I could check... Yeah, I could check Earth and Venus, and I don't know... I'm guessing that it doesn't... Like, they all fall bounties in general. Because they didn't... They didn't specify what bounties or anything, they just said, oh, bounties and... Bounties and void. But does it have to be... Like, does it have to be defense or... I guess survival gives the random items as well, too, so... I would think it could be either. Well, it's not telling me, like, the percentage on the revive. Oh! Hey, hey, none, none of that, please, none of that, please. Here, take, take distraction. I forgot, when you, when they shoot at that, when they shoot at your decoy, then it does, it gets more health, I think. So, yeah, put one there, and shoot at it, so then it gets more. I think? Oh no, they blew it up right away. It's gone. That might be, um, like a Warframe specific mod too, that I don't know about. Because I do have the regenerative uh, regenerative molt, which is a is a mod specifically for this Warframe. Like uh, I forget what they call them. There there's a name for it. Um, because it's it, I think it doesn't have I think it technically doesn't have a um uh, what do you, I don't even remember what you call that now. Uh, polarity, yeah. I don't think it has a polarity. I think it just takes up space. Like, there's not a way to lower the amount of capacity it takes up to put on a Warframe. Which, I guess, makes sense, because it is an ability mod, like, for that specific Warframe. So, I guess it would make sense that it doesn't have necessarily a polarity or anything. It, it might be considered, um, Eximus, though. I didn't think about that, because there is the Eximus slot on the Warframe that you can unlock. Um, but I have not done that for any of my Warframes yet. I think it's... I think it's that. It, it's either Eximus slot on Warframes or weapons. Because I don't think Warframes have it, so never mind. I think it's just weapons that have the Eximus. Um, because you need a... I think it's called a, a, 
uh, Xmas adapter or something like that. So, and that's how you get it open. And it can then you can add another mod to your weapon if you if you have more capacity, or you can increase the uh, capacity by uh, giving a polarity to a slot, and then you have more open. Like. It's just another way of having more form of slots, I guess, or the abil availability to form a slot it, than to not, uh, and to not have it is like, well, if you don't have any Xmas mods that, like if you have more ammo or something, it, it is an extra slot, so it will, um, it would, I guess, technically benefit you to have it unlocked. But at the same time, if you don't have any mods that you think is, like, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, you don't think you have any mods, I guess you could say that make it more efficient or that significantly increase the, um, the weapon's capabilities, then it's, it's not like, I guess it wouldn't be, for me it wouldn't be priority, but at the same time, I guess I kind of would want that to be um, unlocked, just so that I can have that open for extra stuff too. If I have the Exilus adapter or whatever, or Exilus, Exilus, I, I don't remember, um, then, then it would be available and I could get something later on for it and it would be, it would be beneficial no matter what, it's just to what, to what extent, like, is it significant or is it not significant like does it does it just give me extra ammo or something which I usually don't have a problem with or is it gonna do like criticals damage you know something like that that's something I would be more worried about than you know just oh well this gives you some more ammo or like if it's magazine capacity depends on the weapon because if it's a long if it's a longer reload than most weapons then I would go with it, but if it's not, then eh, I don't know. It's 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 really it really depends. Um, oh, now I'm just thinking of uh, what's that one? I can't remember what the shotgun is, but I just oh I I like it. I can't remember. It's pump action though. Um. Oh, I have no clue. No clue. I think it's eight. Eight shells or something, and it has the like a blast ability. I just can't. I can't remember. It's got. It does impact, so it'll knock things down. It's like an area control type of thing. Oh, there we go. Get the regenerative molt on. Get these enemies out of here. Hey, 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 hey. No more of that, please. There we go. Get this on. Now things will be infected, and I'll just let them. I'll just let them get infected, so I'm not like getting shot and die. There, have have distraction. Have distraction. Get distracted. But oh, I forget what gunblade I was using before, because I think I think I actually really I liked it before. Um, I kind of like this too. Like I like the ability to have ranged with the melee. It just seems more like maybe back when it was melee 1.0 and 2.0, it was more convenient to be able to shoot from longer ranges rather than to to have to switch between uh, primary and melee. But now it's just you have primary and you can do quick melee, so you can do you can do a melee and just switch directly back to back to your primary without having to uh, worry about the delay or anything unless you switch specifically to the melee then you have that like one second maybe maybe even less of a delay between switching um, but then you can also do you can do the actual combos to the stance then if you have the melee equipped but I don't usually I usually just do quick melee and if the stance doesn't have um, combos for quick melee that I like on it, then I just, I'll just switch to a different weapon, or I'll try to look up stances that 
maybe maybe would be um, more fluid, I guess you'd say. Because I I like I like quick. Like I like anything that's quick for stances and for just weapons in general. Because I just I just I don't know. I just like I like the noises. I like the noises and I like I like what it can do sometimes. Like if it's if it's the like uh, Dex Furious, uh, Furious, I guess, yeah. The Dex Furious, I, I like those, just because they shoot so fast. Same with the, um, the Grenier, the Gr uh, Gricottas. I like those because they're just, they just shoot faster than the majority of the other weapons in the game. Like, they, anything fast, like SMGs, I've always, I've always enjoyed in other games, too. Like, Anything, anything that's just, you know, like, with the melee, just as quick as you can swing it. Even if it's not necessarily, like, the most damage combo, I just like quick. Quick if I can have it. Oh. Ouch, 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 please. Oh, there we go, I got it. Oh, because my energy is now being used as health. I'm just trying to not die. Get out of here. No more. I don't have any, um... Because, like, I don't use adapt adaptation or whatever on this. I'm just using, uh... Like, I'm using the specific Saren mod that allows for the regenerative, uh... Molt ability. Wait, I'm healing from here? How am I... I'm healing the ground. There, my healing, my healing smoke has gone through the ground into the body. Don't worry, I, 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 I good healer, I good healer. Oh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Here, take that, please, please be distract. No, no more, please. There, knock down the bubble. Oh, and that's another thing that I think I like about the gun blades too. Like the, if they do impact and knock things down. Then, then I'm set. Oh, you, you removed my, my spores. Come on now. No, no, no more shield. Please, no more. Oh, the high level, the high level ones get their shields back in like a second after they're taken down. So I gotta try to be careful about that. We're at 30 minutes. I didn't even realize. Like I've just been I've just been going on and on about like hey this thing that thing woohoo but uh oh 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 okay I think they're ready to extract here we go and also with the regenerative mole I can run faster too here we go are we are we yes we're done all right there we go first first run so do I, okay, Argon Crystals, like, 11? Two. I got two from, for 30 minutes. Jeez, okay, okay, two. So how does that equate? Here, wait, I'm gonna look at something good thing, so I mean, yeah. No. Here we go. Okay. What? Use Aya to trade. Okay, so it tells you. It tells you. Use Aya to trade with Varzia in Maru's Bazaar for Prime Resurgence gear. Yes, okay. I, I knew that, but how do you get Regal? Is it... So it's bought with Platinum? No, no, no. That's a purchase. That's, a, that's like a microtransaction purchase. Does that show up? Okay, no. The Steam overlay does not show up on stream, I was going to say. But yeah, it's a microtransaction purchase. Revenant. Oh, I forgot! I did not get Revenant. I did not get Revenant. 
I don't have Revenant. Okay. Because I remember what... I remember what Revenant is like. But I do not have Revenant. Um... That is another thing that I could be doing as well. If I figure out how to do it anyway. Um, cause I don't, I don't really remember how you get Revenant anyway. Ask of the Revenant. Revenant Blueprint. So, let me go, cause I think that's, that's Earth Bounties as well. Um, so if I do rise from the broken remains of the Eidolon to seduce an army of zealous thralls, but how do I get Revenant? How do I get... How do I... How do I actually get... Um... Here, I'll just message to clan. Do I get... Do I get informations when I do... Revenant? Here we go. It's probably gonna give me the same description. Rise from the broken remains of the Eidolon to seduce... Yes, okay. So how... How get? Revenant... Is awarded investigating the unique mask and... The CAC shop component blueprints are hidden in Cetus Bounty Missions. Okay. Wait, I just don't have the Neuroptics? Oh, but I also don't have a Warframe slot. I didn't think about that either. I ran out of slots and started selling regular Warframes. I have not sold Volt yet because I didn't get Volt Prime yet, so... But I also think I have a majority of the things for that, too. I didn't even think about that. Revenant. How much does Revenant cost without actually doing the stuff for... Because if it's... I might be able to sell Prime stuff for it later to get Revenant. Oh, 325. I think that's... Oh, 375 was the mech. That's what I spent... I spent uh, Platinum on was the mech. But I just usually go in the trade chat and like trade either prime prime sets or I trade like iatans like I I used to trade iatans but not not so much anymore I just kind of have them um warframe what what don't I have arrow how do I get arrow I think I have to do kuva fortress missions and uh, yeah that's not that's not something I think I'm going to do for now Evora prime what, Mesa Prime? Mirage Prime? Necros Prime? Do I have- I think I have Necros Prime. Nova Prime? Where the heck is... Um... Who was I looking for? Can't remember. Um... Oh, Vaban. I need uh, Neuroptics for... Wukong, I have... Or Wukong, I don't know how you say it. Um... I think I'm gonna leave... Yeah, I'm gonna leave this squad, and, um, what do I have in my inventory, actually? I haven't checked this as well, um, uh, Adramalium? Okay, that's something for, uh, Demos, Demos, that's what it was called. I was about, I was about to go look, but now I know, a Demos. That seems like something that you get from there. Um, miscellaneous. Yeah, let me look at the miscellaneous stuff. So, is that... Because I think mis miscellaneous is prime, unless... Oh, no, wait, there's relics. Um, prime part, that's what it is, because the ducats. So I can remove that. So, name, sell price. Um, what do I have? Atlas Prime, I have almost the set for Frost Prime, I only have the Chassis Blueprint, I guess. Naros Prime. Oh, I have a Naros, okay. Or Ineros, I don't know how you say it. Uh, nah, I'm just gonna... Well, I guess I'm gonna go... So, what can I get from Maru's Bazaar for one? For one, Aya? That, that is a question, because I can get... I think I can get relics for one. 
And for two, I think I might be able to get something else other than a relic. That I don't know. That I have no clue about, so... I will check that. I will... I will do... Do a checkeroo on that. Um... Okay... Here I come. I think Var... Var Varzia is the name? Here I come, Var... Var hey. Varzia? Question mark? Maybe? Stand up straight now. Okay, yes, Varzia, okay. Browse wares, what do you got? Prime Vanguard, two the pride of Two Empire. is for the and Regal. The so Regals. Hell How do I get thing. Regal? Can I buy Regal? Can I can I purchase the Regal? I cannot get Regal from from relics. I can just purchase the relics with Aya. So I can only get the relics with Aya, and then I can get the Spectaka Lizette, but I don't... I don't think I want to do that. Um... How... how get... Purchase Regal Aya, but then it just brings me to this... to the... to the website page. Current rotation. Primes were reserved for the Prime right. Vanguard. Is there the any way the to best. get them? And the rest? B3, Are M2, adequate, S4. I Do I if have? Satisfied with you know, I can check if I have these. M2. M. M2. M2. Wait, what? Oh. That's right, Lith M2, or else it won't come up. Here we go, Lith M2, what do I got? Do I have, because I think I have, or I thought I had these. It would tell me if I owned them, I think. Meso B3. Do I have any of these relics though? This question. I don't think I do. S4, what is this for? Boar Prime, Forma Blueprint, Mag Prime, Docker Prime, Nova Prime, Soma Prime. Vasto. Vasto. Boar. Meso B3. I think I have. I have the Soma Prime. I have Docker. I have actually the Dex Docker or whatever. Mag Prime. I do not have Mag Prime. So then I guess I'm gonna go I for. Because I believe in the principles we I'll go for. for Mag Prime. But the day will clear. purchase. Fresh from the past. I'll buy two By of the these. Glory and wisdom of the seven. Yada yada yada. Oh no! Yada yada yada. Oh. Oh, it's going through my head. Yada yada yada. Yada yada yada. I can't remember what Jurassic Park game that was, but it's just going through my brain over and over again. Yada yada yada. Oh, okay. Era Ayatan Aya. Don't go leaving anything unsaid. Now here's a Tenno who looks Aya. at Oricon sequencing medium. Pricks used it to archive everything. Memories, evidence, warframes. The Oricon can rot in their own filth, but those yeah, yeah, but, prime but what about Regal? They deserve to live again, and Regal Aya can make that happen. With Regal Aya, okay, I'm gonna look this up. How to get Regal Aya? Because I know how to get Aya, but I don't know how to get Regal Aya. Regal Aya. Limited time in-game currency, which can only be bought with real-world world currency, it is used to purchase items during Prime Resurgence. When your ah, life's on the okay. line, you're staring down that raging idol. How nothing to get Regalia? I just looked it up. I just put in Regalia. How to get Aya? How to get Regalia? Okay, it's non-tradable, but how do you get it? You wonder... 
purchase. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, While Regal Aya can be purchased with real world money from Warframe Shop, there are some methods to earn the currency for free, so if you don't want to spend cash on some virtual items, you, you'd you better follow this guide. Okay, okay. Although Regal Aya may be a rare item in Warframe's world, there are some activities in the game that will drop some Aya for players. Yes, 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 yes. The first way to earn Aya is complete missions, quest and avoid. Yep, 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 yep. And... It, Run bounties in Cetus, Fortuna, and Demos to earn Regal. These are two guaranteed activities that will drop Aya as a reward. On the other hand, you can find Regal Aya in Relic Packs, which could be purchased from the in-game markets, are obtained from Syndicate offerings. So, Syndicates. Well, I'm gonna go look at my Syndicates then, because I didn't check that. I forgot about the Syndicates part. I thought it was only... I thought it was only in bounties and void. So Enjoy I'll go check my future. syndicates actually. Leave, yes, I'm sure. Let's go. How get how get Regal Aya go syndicate go bounty. Void do not drop, I don't think. So now that I know that, um uh Um I'm invisible. Uh Okay, I'm invisible. I'm literally invisible. Oh, there we go. Now I'm back. Wait, why are these... Why are these down? I guess because I did spend already. Exalted. Regalia. Where you got... Where's the Regalia? Red Veil armor set. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I just got the network not responding. Uh, thing. Network not responding. Network not responding. Oh no. Oh no, please. What's, what's this look like? Oh no, please. Connected. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? I might just restart the the adapter quick. Place manager. Come on now. Come on now. It's it's not saying I got disconnected from the stream yet. How? How question mark how? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Question mark how? Question mark how? I'm still not disconnected. How? Yep, disable. Yep, re-enable. It'll it'll reconnect. It'll reconnect. Don't worry, it'll reconnect. There we go. Okay, now now I got yes, okay. Random, see, like, stuff like that. Just the random, the random disconnect, but, but now that I restarted it, it's fine. It, it, it work it works okay. Like, I don't, oh, but that, see, that, 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 uh, that, what happened there now is that I have a second clip on Twitch now, I think. Wait, I thought I had, um, what do you call it? Uh, cutoff protection. Output stream. Output. I thought I had that on. Audio, replay buffer, audio, video, advanced. Oh, you know, I'm getting a call, so I'm going to mute for now and uh, do a BRB screen.
Um, oh, there we go. Now it's working. See? I don't know why, but my microphone just disconnected entirely. Like, it, it just, it made a, a noise in my ears, and then it just, it did not. It did not. So, wait. So, I was... It said syndicate offerings for for the Aya. The Regal Aya, I think. So is it not actually an available thing? Oh, oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna check. Oh no, I didn't wanna check. I didn't wanna check Twitter. I wanted to check Twitch to make sure. To see what happened. No, no, no. Mute. 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 Oh, whatever. I paused it. So now let me go look. Let me go look at the channel. Because I want to see. Okay. Okay, okay, it did not, it did not. Recent broadcast, one hour ago it says. Is it still going though, is the question. Is it still actually uh, continuing from it, or is it just... Uh, I don't know. Well, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say, well, even if it, even if it disconnected or whatever, it's still... Relic Pack. So, three random relics, one guaranteed rare. Relic packs. Okay, wait, let me look this up again. What? How? Because I think there there is a way to get Regalia. How to get Regalia Warframe. Bounties and... It just says, bounties in Cetus, Fortuna, and Demos to earn Regalia. You can also find Regalia in relic packs, which could be purchased from in-game markets or obtained from Syndicate offerings. Okay, so if I buy relic packs... Three random relics, one guaranteed rare, what secrets exist within them? One guaranteed rare. Well, you know what? I'm not... I don't think I'm going to spend my Syndicate... Um... My, my Syndicate standing on that right away, because I still... Because I think there's still stuff that I want to get from this. Like, the Red Veil armor set, probably, and... Wait, that's part of... Is that not the... Let me look at this. Okay, so... That, that's, that's what the... So that's what the armor set is. So I don't think I actually... Yeah. I think I might. I think I might just do relic packs. Let me see what else I can get from here, though. Razor Wing Blitz, Razor Wing Augment, Flight Speed increased by 25% and Fire Rate increased by 25% for 8 seconds when using abilities. Stacks up to 4 times. Using abilities. Increased at 25% for 8 seconds. And it just keeps stacking up too. Okay, I'm gonna get that, yes. Our enemies will fear you with that. Big... Beguling? Lantern? Beguling? Lantern Augment. Attract enemies... Oh, attracted enemies take 100% more melee damage. More melee damage. Um... I'll get that as well, because I don't have one of those. Spellbound Harvest. Spellbind Augment. Hitting at least four enemies with Spellbind will grant Titania 50 energy. Uh, 
Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Toxic Lash Augment. Create a 5 meter toxic... Oh, create 5 meter toxic clouds dealing 300 toxin damage for 12 seconds with every kill. Damage is twice as strong for melee kills. So that creates more toxin when they get killed. You know what? Yeah, yeah, I'll do that, I guess. I think I'm just gonna purchase all of these, actually, anyway, at some point, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna keep purchasing the mods. Oh, I didn't even realize how many- how many mods were here. Seeking Shuriken. Shuriken Augment hits expose weaknesses on enemies, reducing their armor by 70% for 8 seconds. Okay. Our enemies will there. Now I'm out of- shot. I'm out of Syndicate standing for the Red Veil. Vale view we offerings. Can do for you. Justice Blades. Oh, that's right. Shattered Justice. Wait, I have this? Wait, since when? Oh, that's for... Anything that's for need, the yeah. weapons. That's right. Baycore Heck. I completely forgot about these. But, let me look at the mods still. Later. Atlas. Landslide Augment. Leave a trail for 12 seconds that petrifies enemies for 6 seconds. Tectonic Fracture. Tectonics Augment. Create up to 3 walls which with 100% health. Walls can no longer be turned into boulders. 3 walls with 100% health. So they cannot... They can't turn into roll rollers but that's fine. I'll get use. that. War Gaze, Titanic Rumbler, Rumbler's Augment. Create a single Rumbler with 300% health and 300% damage. Reactivating will cause him to slam the floor and knock down enemies in 15 meters. I'll do that. Hope it helps. Rubble Heap, Passive Augment. When above 1400 Rumble, Landslide costs... No energy deals two times damage and travels two times faster. When above 1400 rumble. Or rubble, rather. I don't know how to do... I don't know how to do that, though. I'll, I'll still get it. No, no, wait, I don't have enough. I was about to say, I'll still get it, though, but I, I will not, because I don't have enough standing to do so. So... So, Regal Aya is bounties. So let me go see... I'll go see bounties then. Uh, I'll go to Earth first. See this. Busy. Last damage will stagger or even knock you down if you're looking... Or if you're too close. Didn't get to read the rest. Oh, here we go. Oh. Okay, there we go. Now I'm on the ground, let's go look. Oh, they're cutting that now, again. Here comes. Here comes. Oh. Here, here, here it comes. Oh, now, now it's coming down. And... Meow. Through it, I go. Yep. Now I'm in. When I, when I crouch, it moves me forward a little bit. Oh, 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 there we go. Oh, there we go. Updates are underway, 0% complete. Please keep your computer on. Oh, okay. Because I'm, I'm updating another device to Windows 11 to see if it is uh, 
if it improves the performance or not, so... Oh, 52%. 64%. Okay. 82%. It's almost there. 100% complete. It says, okay, okay. Got something. Heavy hitter like Bounties, you okay. Snack, now, yeah. is there Regal Aya specifically listed in... Okay, there's Aya listed. Yeah, there's Aya listed. Not Regal Aya, but regular Aya. And then down here, these are the regular, yeah, the regular ones, but they do have eye in it. What about the higher ones? <laughs> Levels 100 to 100. It's got Aya, but it doesn't say Regal Aya. How do I get Regal Aya? Oh... How to obtain Regal Aya in Warframe without buying it? Here we go. Someone's asking on the forums, is there going to be a way to get Regal Aya in-game or is it going to be accessible by buying? While I was reading... Okay, I'm just gonna go through these posts. While I was reading the Prime Resurgence page, I realized it just says that you can buy... Uh, Royal Aya, but I know what they meant. Uh, but it doesn't say if you can gain it any other way in game. You can only buy it, and I wouldn't recommend it at this point. Just read through the Dev Workshop, it's not a good idea. Okay. To keep answer short, Regal Aya is premium currency that we cannot trade and can only buy with real money. Unlike Plat, where we do, do have option to trade. It's because Prime Vault is the key source of their revenue, making a free factor to Regal Aya will really affect their revenue. Someone like me who doesn't grind Plat much still have 17k Plat lying around, so I don't doubt... Their players with 50k plus plat making prime items buyable with their plat or make regal eye tradable with plat will be downside to their business and we will kill the game ourselves. Unless you have every single prime warframe and the majority of prime weapons like I do, them regular eye may or may not be fine. It's occupying the drop source of vaulted relics so it can go either. Way. Okay, so you cannot, you cannot get Regal Aya. There is not a way to get Regal Aya without spending money for the the resource. Okay. See. You up in your rates on. See you again, eh? Because the one website was saying you can. I believe that you can get it through bounties and syndicates, but that's just regular Aya. That that is just regular Aya, not not regal Aya. Because if I bought if I bought relic packs, then I would be getting. I could get regular uh, Aya, but not Regal Aya. There's not a way to get that. If I do... See, here's the question, though. If I do Void Relics, will I get Aya from just doing Void Relics? Or do I need to specifically... Um... Do I need to specifically do only Void Missions? Oh, okay. Well, this is another thing to look up, I guess. So... Can you get Aya, Aya from relics? Aya is it? Yes, 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 yes. Opening relic packs. 
Description. Yeah, 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 yeah. I is in-game currency which can only be earned through opening relic packs, missions in the void, and bounties. It is used to purchase vaulted void relics during prime resurgence. These are not tradable. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, it's showing the rewards, acquisition, view, Aya drop location list, tier 3 void, 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 see this bounty, see this bounty, see this bounty, steel path, see this bounty, yup, 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 yup. Um, anything else that I can, Fortuna, exterminate, yup, void. Oh, 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 ghoul bounty, okay. Interception, void, necrolisk, okay, I can get them from that as well. Yeah, all void. Only can be done, only can be done in the void, so, eh, void relics. Do I have relics that I can use in the void is the question. Because if I do test shub... Axie. Do I have Axie? Oh, I have nine S3s. I didn't... I didn't realize I had nine S3 relics for that. So I could do that. Exterminate. Oh, but it's exterminate. Uh, is there... There's not another... There's not anything else in the void. It's only exterminate, so... So this is just basically another way of obtaining... I guess rarer relics than the normal relics. It's not necessarily like, uh, but you can get vaulted stuff from it. So that that's the difference. You would get relics that do not have unvaulted stuff. And if you're playing, if you're doing this event, then you can get unvaulted stuff. Okay. 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 Now I get it. I get it. I get it. Um, I'll go. Well, I'll get, I guess I'll do the uh, exterminate because I have S3 relics to do it with. So nine of them. I didn't. I didn't even realize I had any relics for the void like that. What is that noise? Oh. <laughs> oh! I forgot that was... Yeah, because the laptop speakers are dead and the GPU in it are dead. Like, the dedicated one. But the integrated one for the processor is not dead. So what it's doing right now is just playing... Every every second, it's just playing... Uh, burp, 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 burp through the speakers because they don't work. So... Because I guess that was connected to what the GPU would have been doing. So, yeah, it's it's just going to play that until until it actually loads Windows. Because then the HyperX... Because, like, I have a HyperX uh, headset, I guess you'd say dongle, uh, plugged in with earbuds plugged into that. So that would... It would switch That's to that it. device uh, because it, you know, if you're not using the default speakers, then it would just switch to that automatically. But even then, I think I would have to disable. I have to disable the speakers from the device manager, or else they just keep doing it because they don't work. They don't work properly. So, because I think something, I think something in it shorted, and it just, yeah, the connections are just non-existent oh it's at 74 percent 74 percent uh if i had if i had a camera to show it i would but it's i don't so I just gotta i just gotta keep you gotta keep you updated on the windows 11 update progress still at 74 percent Please keep your computer on. Your com your computer may restart a few times. Okay. As long as it doesn't corrupt Windows, I'm fine with it. 
because originally when I was installing it, like Windows 10, it, I think it had some issues even with that, so let's see what happens with installing 11 on it. Oh, there we go. Mission complete. Mission complete. Let's go. Oh, missed it. There we go. We're all in the elevator. Meow. Oh, I didn't do... I didn't attempt to jump to see if I go through the roof or not. Um... Orthos Prime. Because I have an Aros Prime, so I'm gonna go for the Orthos. I don't know if I got that or not yet. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. No, I didn't. Because I, or else I think I would have had it mastered. So. Listeners of all ages, I present to you, walking amongst us, the once and future badass. Okay. Mission complete. Excellent work, Ted. I see R889 or 3089. Post Oh. Squad disbanding. Okay, okay, okay. What I got for oh, I didn't want to go on. Oh, oh, 05, that's what I have otherwise. Octavia Prime? I forgot that Octavia Prime even existed. So Yeah, I'll, I'll uh I will make that a radiant then. I'll actually yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that relic for the next extermination. Here we go, 05. Oh. Oh, okay. Thought, I thought it was gonna crash or my network was gonna die. But it did not. It did not. So, good. Oh. Burn. Burn, burn, burn. And it burns, burns, burns. <sighs> the Relic of Fire. The relic of fire. The tower's neural sentry has turned these soldiers hey. into mindless attack drones. No more. You need to take oh, okay. them out. Attack drones? Did she just to say? Did she say attack drones? I don't think I've ever heard that be said. I'm just gonna try to catch up with them. There we go. Activate inside. ability 2. Because I think that might increase the speed of uh, of parkour and stuff as well. And I just went right past. There we go. Now they're up. Now they're up. 84, 87. Oh, what? Well, Windows, Windows is done. Ooh. No more of that. Oh. What frame are they using? They just... They exterminated them. There we go. What the... I think that... I thought that said the organ Argon something, so I just blew it up. In, the, in the expectation of dr it dropping some, but I guess it, it was just an explosive barrel thing. Or explosive, whatever you call it, container. I 
can go I can go even faster now with this because my regenerative uh, molt thing will make me run faster as well. <laughs> oh, but I was running into the railings too. What the heck? Why? Their, their drone is a target. Oh, Enaros Pandero. I'll do the Pandero Prime Barrel. I still got eight more. Eight more Void Relics to do. So wait, do I get... Do I get that for every... For every Void thingy? Welcome, okay. Well, now it's unlocking. Now it's unlocking. What's gonna happen? It's gonna do like the thingy... Hey, welcome to Windows! Here's the features and like... And then I do like uh... Maybe later and skip and then then like I... Then I get access to computer. So let me check this. No. Okay, you do not get... You do not get more for... For just that. I think it is just a rare chance to drop some. Oh, it added, oh, it added apps that I'm not going to use. Facebook, uninstall. Instagram, eh, eh, uninstall. I'll just use the browser version. TikTok, uninstall. Uh, to do, I don't think I'll use that. Disney, uninstall. Wait, what is that? Clip Champ? Clip Champ. Never heard of it, but I'm uninstalling it. Notepad, Office. Notepad, I might. Solitaire. Spotify. Yeah, no, I don't use any of these things. There, now I removed that stuff. Get started. I am not gonna use that. What is this? Chat? chat. What? Yeah. Chat. And I can't remove it from the taskbar. It's just called chat. Just chat. This is this. Whoa. Focus, dis uh, focus assist. They changed this. Oh, they changed this. This is... This is different. Device manager. Let me go through this. Let me turn off the, the noises. So wait, let me see if I can... Yeah, if, if you could hear that, that is the noise. That's the noise it makes because it does not have operational. It does not have operational speakers at all, so... Uh... Speakers... Disable. Yes. Oh, no. That didn't- that didn't do it. Realtek High Definition Audio. Uninstall. I don't want to uninstall. Disable. There we go. There we go, I got it. I got it. Now it's not making the burp, burp, burp. It's not making the noise. It's not making the noise anymore. Storage controllers. Whoa! Wait, what? Intel R chip SATA slash PCIe RST premium controller. Never, never have I seen that device in Device Manager ever. So, uh, yeah. Well, does this, does this improve? Does this make things... Uh, work? Better? Question mark? I don't know, I'm just, I'm... <sighs> there. Wait a second though. Wait, what? Oh, that's the new desktop thing. Okay. T 
type here. Oh, the type here is not... Oh, because I'm... <laughs> I, was, I was typing on my desktop's keyboard, not on the actual... ...laptop's keyboard. I end up doing that sometimes when I'm trying to use it. Because it's off to the side, but I expect, like, I expect the keyboard to work with it, even though it's not plugged into it. Display? Whoa. Whoa, they changed. Yeah, this got changed. Okay, I don't even recognize this at all. Graphics? Custom options? Gaming. Well, game bar can be off. I turned off game mode on 10, so... So then now it's off on here, I guess. Okay, okay. What was I gonna do? Bluetooth and devices. Bluetooth is turned off, but do I have... View more devices. Okay, okay, so it is still connected. But what happened to... What happens with Edge, though? Because Edge has... Okay, okay, kept my... kept my settings. Listen to music. Yeah, I'm just gonna let that go. So... Relics, 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 relics. So this is the one that's available to be done. Like, I can do exterminate, but then I don't have I think I have less of a chance of getting of getting Aya from it so um I think I'm gonna do that survival interception sabotage mobile defense defense is there a higher defense mobile defense well, what is this? Energy drain mode, low gravity mode. Um... Mobile defense, what is this normally? Okay, it's normally a mobile defense anyway. So... I'll do survival then. I guess that's what... Because there were three groups that were open, open squads three, yeah. So I'm gonna do survival. Okay, since this is still this is still technically connected, is my playlist still? Nope, my playlist is not the same as it was. So then Ow, 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 ow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I was doing something. Please don't attack me. Oh, oh which which sound device is this attached to? Okay, I think it's attached to the right device. I can't tell though because the, the UI is different than what I remember it being, so... I can't tell if, if it is actually the right device or not. The, well, the one I want to play it through. Okay, that doesn't break. That doesn't break these uh, containers. <laughs> I just wanted to see if it did though, because then I would have been able to break them all and then just do the collection through the, uh, through the lockers. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. hey. No more. No more. No more. Get out of here. I can... Oh. Uh, the split up though. The the network losing connection. That that just split split the stream I think into two two different ones. 
But if that's the case, then the video after will not be split, but the stream actually will be. Unfortunately. So it'll be two separate ones, technically. Unless it just was saying that the one hour and eight minute thing was still being continued, hence why it didn't have a thumbnail or anything, so... I'll have to check after I'm by. Hey, get out of here. Enhance. Pick up four... Okay, eight rare mods to get that for the uh, night wave. I just keep forgetting about my primary weapon. Do I have redeemers at level 26? So if I use it a little bit more, I'll be at full level with it. I didn't, but I forgot. I could probably put, I think I can put more mods on it. If not, then after I get to level 30, I will be able to. Okay, take, take, take the decoy. Oh, someone's down. Toothless. Wait, where are they? Oh, over here. Oh, they, they're up, they're up, they're, they're, they're not down anymore. They're up. There, drop. Drop some spores. Drop some, uh, what is this? Miasma. Here, take some miasma. Oh, here we go. Pick this stuff up. No more. No more turret. No more. Okay, that one's already deactivated. Robotic lockbox. Oh. What the heck? Oh, they're gone. Oh, they're back. Hey. No more. There. These ones just disappeared, though. They're gone. Here. Fight. Fight my decoy. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go over here with them, in this room. Oh yeah, here we go. Pick up all the, all the stuff on the floor. Oh, 13 infected, okay, okay, okay. 14, 12, 11, 10, 9, 10, 9. <laughs> Eight, seven, oh, 20. Okay, it's fluctuating, but it's it's. I still got infected. Oh, six, five, four, seven, five, four, five, four, three, five. I'm surprised it still hasn't dropped off yet. Two, one. Oh, there we go. There it is. Because after a while, if it does, if it starts doing high levels of damage, the things will die and then it won't spread anymore, so... I haven't done any damage mods on it, because I wanted to make sure... I wanted to make it spread further rather than do a bunch of damage. Yeah, because it'll only go up, like, I think one by each infected. But then once it gets to higher values, it starts going up faster, question mark. I'm not entirely uh, sure how it works. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how it works, if I, if I didn't say that properly, but... Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't get it. I just know that the damage numbers go up when there's infected, and the more infected, the higher they go. Or, well, the quicker they go up. Pick this up. Oh, there we go. Pick that up. Oh, 
Oh, they're scared by, uh, I can't remember. Nesha, that's the name. By Nesha. There, do my asthma. Oh, and this is a closed off room, so no enemies can spawn in here. I didn't even remember. So, on the last mission, I think I got like eight, eight, uh, Argon Crystals. Though I don't know what I, I don't know if I have anything to really make with them. I just have that many now. But they take, I think they take 24 hours to decay. Like one will decay and then another one will after another 24 hours. So eight of them would take, that would literally just be eight days of at least having one Argon. And I don't, I think the most amount of Argon crystals I've seen something take was maybe two or three, so. I, I can find, I could maybe find something to use, use them with, or use them on rather. Get out of here. Oh, I just knocked them over. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to trip you, but also, I was still, I, I guess I was still gonna kill you. So. Hey. No more. Back up. No more. Does this break the spores? I think shooting them with this breaks them and spreads them. Hey. No more, no more. There we go. Just try to get as many infected as I can. Whoa, I just shot them. I think I shot them into the water. Oh yeah, they're dead. Oh no, they're not. They're up, they're up. Oh, now they're dead. Via the teammates that I have. Oh, 14. 12, 10, 11, 13. Yeah, now that's just gonna, it's gonna fluctuate. Oh, two, one. Hold out uh, as long as you can. Yeah, it's done. There it is, decaying. But I also don't have, um... Because I did, I did efficiency for the trade-off of less, less time, I think, on the abilities, so... So I don't have, um, long before it starts to decay, uh, down to nothing. Because when it's on and I got multiple enemies, then it'll go up, you know, fairly, I would say fairly quickly, but uh, if if I don't got nobody, then it, it goes down to zero within maybe, maybe even just a couple seconds or so. There we go. 20. 20 infected. Oh, I didn't want to do that, but that's fine. It'll make sure I don't lose any health. Oh, I remember now. So there was a glitch um, back when I was playing survival one time, and I went for literally three hours solo. But I ended up dying and losing everything because uh, I just wanted to keep going. Like, because the glitch was I wouldn't be attacked for some reason. Like. Enemies would stop attacking me, so I just would sit in the middle of this and just keep spamming my abilities to kill them. But, yeah, no, three hours solo, and enemies were getting up to, like, I think past level 300. Like, they were, I think I got them up to, like, 600 and something before I got killed. But I, it took, I don't know how much it took to kill them. I just remember it being, like... I would have to sit there for at least a few seconds before one of them would be dead. Like, I guess that could still be now with certain enemies, but like, it was every enemy. It didn't matter what kind of enemy it was. It would, I would have to sit there for a few seconds just either firing my weapons into them or meleeing them or just spamming abilities because they, they, they wouldn't die. You know, just like, just like that. Oh. There we go. 
Like that, see that was a couple seconds, but a few seconds. And then it's, then it's about the same amount of enemies as what's going on here. And it just, to clear the room it took, I don't know, at least a minute or something. But I had to keep activating uh, life support because I couldn't kill them fast enough to collect the, uh, collect, to collect the personal life support modules. Like, I, I just, I had to go to other rooms eventually and then come back here once, once I cleared those out because they'll just, they'll keep rotating positions then once you activate them in one room and then move on to another. So they would eventually rotate back to this room, but this is, this is where my uh, choice for survival, like which room in these kind of uh, void missions would be. Like I would just sit in the the round room, just because there's more there's more entrances slash exits, so more enemies I think will spawn in bigger rooms like this, just because of that fact. Like if you sit at the end, like a dead end hallway or something, they don't spawn as fast, I don't think. But it's also easier to defend because there's only one entrance, so. Like, you can go, you activate the life support modules every once in a while, but, you know, it'll it'll take a little bit before you have to. So you just sit in the end of the hallways and do that, as long as you have abilities that are powerful enough to kill them before they get in and overwhelm you. Um, I can... Oh, where'd my... Oh, they went this way. They moved on to this room. There's another room over here. Like these rooms are okay, I think, because they, yeah, they have they have like six entrances slash exits, maybe even more. Might be like eight or something. But I think it's the more entrances and exits, more enemies will spawn. But then again, I don't I don't really know. I haven't really tested it. Oh, here we go. Oh. oh, I was gonna mercy them, but it was too late. I was already past the, the point of mercy. Fight, the more successful we will be. I was just spamming the the gun blade. Yep, knock them over. I like weapons though that can knock over the enemies because then you can uh, perform the finishers as well. Because they do. I don't know how much finishers do actually, I think that's also dependent on mods too. Like there's a finisher damage mod, but I don't usually use them. I usually try to use stuff that is pretty much all the time consistent, like, because there's a chance you'll knock over an enemy, but you can guarantee, you know, if you're right next to him, you'll hit him, so if you have like, damage, for instance, are like, a, an effect or whatever, an element, um, like an elemental effect, or if you had a, uh, uh, what do you call it, um, oh, or like poison, toxin, any of that stuff. It's not poison, it's toxin, yeah. Because I don't think there is poison technically in this game, it's just called toxin. Here we go. Or like viral damage as well. Here we go. But I've always... I started doing viral because I was told, hey, uh, viral damage and... What is it? Viral and... Slash. If you mix viral and slash together, then that's a good combination from what I've heard. But I also don't... Like, I don't really experiment that much either. I just kind of left things how they were for a while. Um, but I... I've experimented more with Warframes, I think, than weapons. Just on the fact that, like, um, like abilities. Usually, usually I rely on a couple abilities to keep me alive. Like, for instance, like Molt. I use Molt and Spores a lot on this, and then when when the enemies aren't dying uh, as quick as I would like them to, I just do that, and then it clears them out. Usually, unless I'm like high high level, high wave, something like that. Um, oh, I didn't even realize. Well, our one person's leaving. Toothless is. But I'm still going. I'm still, I'm still, you know, 
fine with going longer. As long as I can survive, I'll just keep going. Because I, I would go, like, I would literally go for hours at a time, like, or, well, out an hour at a time, or an hour and a half at a time. If, if people stayed to, uh, do it or whatever, I would do it for however long they stayed. Usually it's on maps that have rooms, though, where, where usually the team, uh, sticks together, no matter what, so. But right now, we're kind of split. But I think, I think it is also the fact that the more rooms you're split between, the more enemies that will spawn because then there's not really... Like, I think that's for performance as well as, like, uh... That wouldn't really be server because then that would be technically more load to do, but that's... That's the thing, they don't have servers. I, I, I completely forgot about that. They don't have... They don't have dedicated servers. It's basically off of whoever's IP is the host. Like, whoever is technically the host of the game is whose uh, ping you're going to be uh, dealing with. So. Because if they had dedicated servers, then there would be probably less... There'd probably be less to disconnects, but then they would also have to pay for those servers, so... It would cost them more money to be doing that, so that's probably why they don't do it. But at the same time, it would be, you know, beneficial to players who don't necessarily have, like, the, I guess you would say the best connection to the other players. Now, here's, here's the thing, though. Can other... Like, can other regions play with... Like, are all the regions connected, are they not? Because I don't think they are. Like, the Asian servers, I think, are separate from EU and US. Unless unless the Asian and EU are together, and then it's just the US that are split. Oh, there we go. We found Aya. We got one. Just use that. Oh, yeah. I forget what I even have on this. Oh, they're down. Dracona. Draconicus. Or. Draconicus. I think that's how you say that. I'm just gonna pick up these. See if I can find any modules in these. Nope. Nope, no modules. Can you get life support modules from lockers? I'm pretty sure you... Like, if I remember correctly, you can, but I have not, I don't think. On this one, at least. I don't remember getting them from the other ones, either. I think you're just more likely to get them from the, the containers on the ground. Could be wrong, though. Oh, here's one. Where are they at? I'm gonna try to get to them. Oh, they're still in here. Oh! The loot. I think that's... I think that's probably the cause for a little bit of lag, is the amount of loot that was in the middle of the room. Oh, that's... that's great. Go get out of here. Oh. Oh, okay. I thought my game was gonna crash, but it didn't. It didn't crash. It didn't crash. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, but I don't know what happened there. I don't know why that happened. But I'm I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. What's up? There we go. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Let me pick him up. Draconicus. Oh. 
Oh, 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 corrupted. There we go. Get out of here. Get out of here. If only there was... Oh, no, 30 Xmas. If only there was a survival mission that I could open relics on. Because I still have those eight other ones to open that are Axie. I think they're Axie. Anyway. No more. No more. There we go. Leave the decoy in the middle. So when they go for it. What the heck is that? It sounds like... What the heck? What frame are they using that it does that? I was thinking, um... Oh, what is it? What is their name? I can't remember the name. Atlas, yeah. Are they using Atlas? I can check. No, oh, they're both using Nesha Prime. So what is that? I don't know what that ability is. I don't think I use it very often. Hey, out of here! No more. No hanging. No hanging out on this ledge. Get out of here. No more. Oh, the energy. The energy orbs. There were like five of them right there. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. No more. Look at them. They were skewered, okay. I was I was wondering why is that one just standing there like that, but it, it was skewered. It was stuck. Just like them up there. There's three of them. Another relic. Oh, I wonder how long. I wonder how long we're gonna go on this one. Here we go. Hey, 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 hey. No more, no more. Oh, I had one. Oh, five. There, now I have more. I think. Well, maybe. Oh, 15. There we go. Just did some fire and it broke the spores. Now there's like eight of them. Nine. Eight. Five. Four. Oh, because it's doing like almost 700 damage. Yep, now it's up to 700. 8. 6. 7. Oh, there we go. Now they got taken out. No, no, no. No shield. No shield. Oh, I forgot. I forgot how much damage this did. Yeah, no. Just dead. I've just been trying to use the Redeemer to level it up, but... There, 10. Knocked over one up there. No more. Five. Let me see if I can find any more groups. 300 damage. 360. Where are the groups? Oh, there's one, there's one enemy here. I'll just, I'll just have them. There, I'll just, I'll just get them infected. Let's see if I can... Yeah, no. I think it's gonna get lost. Oof. Maybe more spawns on the host, actually. 
I didn't think about that either. Maybe the host is what determines where the spawn room for enemies is as well. Because I've noticed sometimes, like, it seems like there isn't that many enemies in one room, but then when I go to someone else's room, there's like, you know, there's like a whole group or something. So, oh. No, no, no. No more of that. No nullifier. Level 28, but it's... With the bonus, it'll probably be level 30, so... But for for the in-game right now, it's gonna be level 28. Until you get out of it, then you won't get the extra stance combo slash... Uh, extra damage and slots, so... There you go. Out of here. Hey, 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 hey. No more of that, please. No more of that, please. 12, 11, 10, 8, 7. You were not infected. 5. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. 1. 1. There. You... There, be activated. Now you carry, you carry for the others. Infect. 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 Yes. Now we got five infected. Oh, there we go. When they do the skewer thing, I'll just infect the skewers. Because they seem to... They seem to actually take less damage when they're skewered, unless I'm just... Looking at it wrong, but... Because I've used that ability before, but it seems like they die... They don't die as quick. Maybe it's just because of the melee I use. Or... Yeah, yeah, maybe it's just the melee combos not hitting it... As often, just because it's meant for hitting them while they're stationary on the ground. Hey. Oh. Oh, there we go. It wasn't letting me to use my second ability. There. Oh. The amount of health and energy orbs. Well, I got my health back. Look what our Tenno operative just found. They could not do this without you. No more. No more, no more. Get out of here. Take out these enemies up here. Okay. And seven. Hey, you be activated. You get activated. You carry. You carry the disease. Oh, skewer. Give it to the skewer. Now it'll spread it. Yes. The disease will spread. It'll spread over the skewers. To the many more enemies that come into the room. Now the question is, do they attack the skewers that the other enemies are on? Is that why the infection rate is faster, or...? Because if they do, they're just shooting the spores themselves and they get closer to it to try to aim more accurately. So... That would make more sense to as why, like, the infection rate goes up faster when I do it to them. 11... yeah. 10... 9... 10... Because it seems to be more consistent, like it... It keeps the rate up, it seems, when when I do it to those enemies. Get out of here. I'm getting shot by shotgun. There we go. No more. I would I would prefer not to have buckshot in me, please. Thank you. Knock him off. player waiting. Sorry. 
Draconicus. I'm trying to think of the one weird from Toto Africa. Something about she's waiting there for you. I can't remember the rest of it though. Oh. Pick up the life support module. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, 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 hey. Calm down, calm down. I'll give you I'll give you your spores, please. Yeah, this is kind of similar to what happened. This is it's just put down put down the molt the molted copy, and then while they're distracted, use spores on them. Because then they'll gather around. Yep, there we go. Now, now, now I got a group. Oh, but then the nullifiers, though. No, 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 no. No nullify. Ooh. I'm getting. Yeah, I'm getting, uh. Hoo hoo hoo! I was getting uh, a little bit of a stun there. I was getting low on health, so it was gonna stun me if I did it. Are they host? Yes, they were. They were the host. I was about to say if they their host, well, I'm getting disconnected. But yep, they were. They were in fact the host. So who's the host now, is the question. Is it going to be me, or is it going to be them that's the host? Oh, I, f I grabbed the wrong mouse. There we go. Out of here. No more, no more. Nine infected. Just keep getting the skewered, the skewered ones. There, the skewered ones can get the infect, and then the, it'll be, I think, higher probability of others getting infected. Get out of here, nullifier. No more. No more nullifier. No more of you, either. There. The longer you Take fight, that. The more successful we will be. Oh, almost 40... So at 35 right now. Oh, are they are they done? Okay, no, they're not. They're not getting them through the bottom of the the floor because this will go through walls and stuff too. Seven infected. Just tap it to try to break the spores. Oh, there we go. Just put it on the towers. Just put it on the skewers and let them go. It'll just keep building them up. Oh, until this though, until the Arctic Christmas comes in, because then I can't take away the nullifying until I break down their their Arctic globe around them, their mobile globe. out of here. No nullifiers. No nullifiers allowed. You shall not nullify my abilities, please. 
collect stuff in here. There we go, 80 endo. Three minutes, three minutes. There, fight that. Hey, get out of here. No, 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 you're not supposed to fight me, you're supposed to fight my copy. Get out of here. Yeah, there you go. See, fight that. Yeah, fight that now. Oh, good. Oh, no. Whoa. Just did like a shot through the fire of my own gun. Uh, well, of my own flank, though. No more of that. Take this, take that, and I'll do this. See? It all works out. What is that though? The pullback. I think the combo... Once I get it to level 30, the combo will be not like that. It's like... That. Yeah, that. I don't know how I feel about that. There, put spores on the one skewer. Oh, and they're dead. They're gone. They took out the nullifier. Oh, and it just exploded the spores on 13 of them. Okay. Okay. 11. 10. 8. Uh, I don't know if we'll be able to keep it up though. Put spores on that one. Let him be. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let them build up. Let's keep them going. There we go. Seven, eight. Oh, it's on them. I didn't even see. They're running around with the spores on. It's like it's like jewelry. <laughs> Except it's toxic spores. Just don't let them explode or they cover other people. Oh. I'm getting the He was giving me the uh the little bit of a a stammering, I don't know what you call that, uh... Like a stutter step because I was losing all my health. And then it was using energy instead to try to preserve my life. There we go. Eight. Oh, my wrist. My wrist is like broken from jumping and rolling. How long do they want to go for is the question though. We're at 40. We're at 40. Hey. Fight that. Don't fight me. Fight that. Activated. I'm almost at level 100 enemies. Almost there. We're at 84. Okay. This'll stun him. This'll stun him. Don't worry. I'll just start stunning him with this. Instead. Oh, but my melee. The melee combo... How long do I want to stay? Forever. given that answer before, uh, but I forget what the reaction to it was. I'm just gonna keep going as long as I can live.
Oh, they gave the straight face. Just the straight face. Drain health to keep me alive. Oh, oh, okay. It's starting to get. Oh, yeah, it's starting to get a little bit. There we go. Oh, there you go. Put it on that. Put on. Put it on the skewer and let it go. I think it's because it's either because the skewers do constant damage, so it just breaks the spores. Uh, like it'll it'll just slowly break them down, and then more enemies get uh, spored. Or, or it's the thing I said before, where the enemies will attack them themselves, and then and then since they're getting closer and closer, they're just putting more spores on themselves because they want to try to get a better shot, so the AI says, hey, get closer, then you get more accurate, so. Oh, I can't pick that up through there? Okay, there we go. I was about to say, I thought I could pick those up through the floor, or, or I guess not that one. That one didn't go. Because I think it's 13 meters is my pickup range for stuff. Ooh. Oh, they were still... Oh, I think they were skewered. Here. There, I'll put it on the skewer. Now it'll just slowly disperse. It'll disperse the, ske the spores from the skewered enemy. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. No more of you. Get out of here. Look for a skewer. Where are the skewers? Oh, 44. Almost 45 minutes in. Activate one of these. Here we go. Skewered enemies up there. Do they attack them themselves, though? Or is it just the fact that they're skewered because it does... I think it might be just the fact that it, they're skewered so it does damage. Like it'll... Do damage enough to disperse that. Okay. Yeah, now I'm up to 11 infected. It was lower, but then it just got up. So I don't know if it's the incremental damage or if it's just maybe it's the amount of enemies now that are spawning. Oh. Yeah, but I think this might actually get up to... We might go for an hour, actually. Oh. Hey. No more. Please no shoot me with that. 16. I'll just let it keep building. And roll around. Get out of here with that. No nullifier. Oh. That combo. The the pullback combo with it. I don't I don't know if I Oh, ow, ow, ow. There we go. Get get health back. Get health back. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that pullback combo on the on the redeemer. Because it just feels like it doesn't connect with the other attacks as much. No more. No more. Just get him with that. Get him with that. Oh wait. T is the... Oh, no, no, no. T is not. T is not what I was looking for. Caps lock. Yeah. yeah. Q? Oh. No. Tab. Yes, tab. Oh. I'm 
doing 21% damage. I didn't even realize. I thought I was doing more than that, but I guess not. Activate that one, and go back. Hey, okay. There we go. Back. Take my decoy. Six infected. Move the nullifier's bubble. Oh. One on a skier. There you go, put it on that. Oh yeah, I was just gonna stand there and let him do it to me. Put it on the skewers. Let it cook up. I'm just... I'm just marinating. I'm just marinating the bodies, don't worry. Here, let me cook them. Here you go. I'll just let them be then. Once they get to there, I just let them go. Yeah, I forgot. This... Because this does... This does slash and viral, so... But it also lights my fire, so it'll also keep them in place. Yeah. So I can just stun them and do it. Oh. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Yo, oh, hey, there was one behind me before I jumped. Didn't even get a look at him. Oh, they're throwing their disc. <laughs> Just bouncing around the disc. We will all share in this bounty. Hold oh, we're at 50. We're at 50 minutes now. Picking up health orbs. There we go. Put them up. Got to drop and scores around. Like that one up. I think levels. while they're on fire, they is your best the spores will break too. So if I just if I just score one. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, I was trying to keep it going. Like, I'm just trying to light them up. Yeah, there we go. Get the spore spreading. Maybe. Nope, nope. Okay. Ooh. GG. Oh, they're, they're gone. They're going. Hey, there we go. Now I got my health back. Uh-oh. Here we go. Regain more. I'm coming, I'm coming, don't worry. Yeah. Mission complete. GG. Excellent work, Tenno. There we go. Send him a GG and let oh yeah. Yeah, there we go. Two. Two. So I think it's every twenty. Every 20 waves, I think it's... 
uh, when we get Aya, so... Now I can upgrade the Redeemer. Oh yeah, I, I got 22 capacity left over. I didn't even realize. Um, does this do... Oh, this does Slash. High Noon, okay, what... Do I have another stance? Oh, I don't have another stance for this. So it is just... Just that. Well, this is a Slash weapon, so... Oh... Yeah, there we go. Just Slash up. Toxin, Gladiator Rush, combo duration. Impact, Jagged Edge, more Slash. Just maximum Slash. What's the... I only have Toxin on this? I thought I had Viral on this. Toxin. No, I don't. Well then, let me actually do that instead. Um... Cold. Yeah, because I have that, so that'll increase the status chance as well. What's the combo on this? Uh, or what's the critical, rather? Where is the critical value? Whoa, whoa, wait, damage? Okay, where... Critical chance is 10%, okay, so... This is more towards... Elemental attacks, then, I guess. Rather than the criticals, so... That's what I'd be working on with this one. Uh, Berserk Fury. Focus Energy. Fury. I have four. Polarity. Ah, here we go. Drain. What do I have that can be put on for four? Let's kill. This is only taking four. So I could do... I could do more Toxin. Talk, toxin. Yes, they were. Now I got one left open. So now I got viral and slash. And I would have to do. I'd have to forma to get more capacity. Which I would do probably that. Upgraded. They changed this too. I didn't. I haven't seen this in a while, but they just made this, I guess, more easily visible, I would say. Because these got, I think, increased in size, so. Polarization. If I'm going to polarize it, I think I'll do a V. Yeah, I'll do a V. Yep. Install Forma V. Apply. Yes. It'll get reset, but that's fine. Yeah, because I'll I'll just re-level it. Wait, why did I? Why did I do that? Because the Redeemer Prime exists too. So, oops, <laughs> oops. Um. But do I have Redeemer? I did have it at one time. It was... I did master it already. So, you know what? Actually... Uh, uh, I know I just formed it, but... You know what? How much, how much space do I have in my... I don't know. Not Arsenal. I want to go equipment, inventory. How much weapon space do I have? I have two open slots. But if I wanted to do like two Viper Wraiths together, I have another slot open. Eh. And I have enough, so that means I have two slots open to make a dual weapon. Furious, when did I... When did I acquire the f this Furious? Did I not? Did I? M I thought I already. M did I not master it? Inventory. No wait. 
I guess I didn't master it already. Um. It'd be AK or dual. I don't I don't remember what I would do for that. AK here or AK or Nope. Um How do I Well I guess I'll go into the arsenal because then I can actually just look at what it's called together. A Furious. Okay, it's A Furious. A Furious. A Furious. Okay, so I did master. I mastered duel, but I did not master single. That's why I think I got it. So I can master it. Well, let me check because this says if I did or not as well, so. Unless I'm just not seeing it. No, I mastered it too. Huh. Why do I have. Why do I have a Furious in my inventory? I still don't understand. Why is this in my inventory? I I don't know. Why why is it in my inventory? I'm gonna sell it, but I already mastered it, so I figured that's why I would have it, because I did maybe the duels first and didn't master the single, but Yeah. Well there, now I have I have three. Yeah, three weapon slots open. So I don't really have to worry too much about this. Oh, I didn't mean to... But I didn't mean to former it, though, I guess. Because I did already have it. I just didn't... Well, do I have anything that I can get the Redeemer Prime back? Redeemer. Oh, Redeemer. Redeemer Prime Blueprint. Okay, I already have that, though. What was I missing? Prime Handle? Was I missing the Prime Handle? Neo R4. What is the Neo R4? Well, Redeemer. Redeemer Prime. That's it. I'm just missing the handle. But why did I... Why did I get rid of the Redeemer Prime is the question. Like, I... I don't... You know, let me look at its stats. Re... I don't want to do that. Redeemer... Prime. Why did I get rid of the Redeemer Prime? Maybe because it wasn't... Um... What do you call it? It didn't have... The doubled capacity on it or something. And I just got rid of it because, well... I didn't... I guess I didn't... I wasn't worried about getting the double capacity and keeping it? Question mark, or I was out of space and I just got rid of it because I didn't have space anymore? Um... Critical chance 24 Oh, Well, this has both critical and status at almost the same values. What is... But what I what would I be normally using? Is the question. Uh oh. It says I'm having connection problems, but but I'm still. Oh, there we go. Now it's dropping. Huh. Don't know why though. Like this, this happens randomly out of nowhere. Like I don't know what the issue is. It just happens, and um, then it goes. Now it's fine. Yeah, now now it's okay. Now it went back up to like. Oh, that is using. Oh, that was significantly higher usage than normal. Jeez. And yeah, now it's fine. But, regardless, 
What do I normally use? Well, I have a Prisma Skana. These I was trying to get, um... Yeah, these I was trying to get double capacity, I think. Orkin Catalyst, and I don't have any Platinum for it, so... Um... Is this normally what I use? Slash 225. But what's the actual value on it? 562. Here's my actual weapon. The the big candy cane. Slash 222.5. Puncture 135 or 137.5. Impact 215. But this has See, this has viral by default of, uh, what, what is it? Upgrade. Okay, wait, I can check the default value. There we go. It has a default value of 68 viral on its own. So I think that's why I was, yeah, that's why I was using this. Because it has viral already on it by default just because of the the top part yeah the actual part that's here is what is what gives it its viral value well upgrade do i do i keep doing it or do i not appearance visible when holstered I forgot I had these. Maybe it's just because of these skins. I don't I don't remember. Energy. I'll make this it's that color. Yes it is, okay. I guess so? I I get I guess for just the, the skins. I, I I I don't know, but I have it regardless, so Um Yeah. I'm gonna check something quick while I'm at it. Okay, good. This is muted. Now I can look at the channel. Okay, it didn't split the streams. That's that's what I was just checking, but um I think I think I'm going to be done for now. So um thanks for sticking around if you did. Uh and uh yeah, I'll uh I think I think I don't know if I should do do what I normally do. I would just do like the the drawn out see you later, but I think I think I think I'm just gonna do. Uh, I'll 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 just I'll just do normal, but I'll uh, I'll see you I'll see you later. Uh, yeah. <laughs>